back to Vroom Vroom Data, man, out here on the dual sport. And today, my friends, we got a dual sport ride set up, man. I'm out here with my dad. Uh, he actually took the weekend off of work since it's Christmas weekend, uh, so we're able to take him out. He's got his dual sport out. I got my dual sport out, and we got a ride set up for today. So I'm pretty excited for today's video, to be honest, man. It's been a while since I've actually put together like a little bit of a loop on the dual sport, so there's gonna be a ton of six spots we're hitting today, and uh, it's very exciting. Dude, I wish I could. I know some good trails back here. He's all right. Oh yeah, what I was saying back there, I was like, is that thing good at those high speeds? I remember you oh. said it sucked. No, because you got the WR. Yeah. Obviously, this is a motocross bike. So yeah. the gearing's not. I mean, we we're only going 55. That's about my max. <laughs> that's crazy. All right. What's up, dudes? I did it to make it more hard, and then the deep got really right, or the rut got really deep. Are you recharging? Give myself a challenge, and then the rut got too deep. All right, let's go. Way to start a video right there. <laughs> I was like goofing around. I was like, oh, this looks a little bit more technical. And then next thing you know, I'm in like a three foot rut that I can't get out of. <laughs> Man, that was a sick trail. Never found that one before. Kind of cut through the hills instead of taking fire roads. Get your little single track practice. That was actually uh, pretty dope. I like that. Hey, you want a f you want a free excursion? Nope. Are you sure? Yep. I wonder what happened. Well, it either broke down or it's stolen. <laughs> Sweet. I'll take it. We have found so many stolen vehicles in the past month it's been absolutely ridiculous just a couple days ago we found a stolen u-haul and now we come out today and we find a stolen excursion like what the heck is going on lately is everybody getting their stuff stolen a word of advice from vroom vroom man lock your stuff make sure your doors are locked because i guess it's stealing season for a bunch of people i don't know if i'm going to set up a loop that involves dual sport riding your boy's going to take the infamous tree trail it's just a part of my loop, we gotta run it backwards. So I think I've only done it backward once, so it should be pretty fun, but I don't know, man. I'm excited to put this thing all together. Now that it's starting to come together, I'm like super excited about it. Oh my gosh, you flew down that thing. That was awesome. Not really. I think that mirror you're talking about just broke probably. Well, help me pick it up. <laughs> Oh gosh, actually it didn't. All right, I got it. Oh, what is that? The heck is that? Is that gas or oil because it's upside down? Oil. Because it's upside down? Yeah. Jeez. Um, here, hold on a sec. Oh yeah, it got all over me. I looked behind me and you were up it. No problem. Yeah, I was like, what happened? Off the edge somehow. <laughs> the hard part was landing on the sticks. Oh, up here? Yeah, I heard it. I think I punctured my. <laughs> it was gnarly. You're not supposed to fall. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen you fall like that in a while. <laughs> a little bit. Oh, hold on, hold on. You're roosting me. Um, here, kill it, Dad. I could bring the back tire over that way. I can't walk. Woo, yeah. Oh man, that was exhausting. Oh my God, dude, that was freaking gnarly. <laughs> wow, man, my dad just launched off of that cliff into the brush. I was like, oh my God, our ride's already ended. It's over. <laughs> nope, we're good. Everything's okay. Uh, now we're on the back side of the farm. We're heading out of the farm to probably go get some lunch down at a shopping center because after the shopping center, we got to go into some more hills and then some more hills. I'm telling you, man, it's going to be a freaking sick video. Alright, we're 
good. We're good. Your elbow's not. Oh, that's not that bad. Wow, how embarrassing. That's some rough asphalt there. Yeah, that hurt. Yeah, it's all right. Dude, how embarrassing. I don't want to talk about it. Oh, God, that freaking hurt. Oh, my God, dude. How freaking embarrassing. I don't even want to talk about that. Oh, man. I was reaching for the back brake, and I just couldn't find it. I knew the balance point was coming. I was reaching, I was reaching, and I just... Uh, Jesus Christ. Show must go on. Fine. If you're lightheaded, you can just west a little bit. Nah, that's good. I just need to take a break right there. I think I'm just a little dehydrated. And that hurt like hell. Holy moly, did that not feel good at all, man. Totally ruined my whole vibe right there, man. I am uh, I'm in a little bit of pain right now. There's no doubt about it. I'm just glad I wasn't wearing my uh, new jacket I bought. I would have been pretty upset if I tore my jacket right there, but... I got some pretty good road rash. Uh, that was a very, very rough road. It was not like a normal gravel road. For some reason, that one like had lava craters and craters from the moon on it. And uh, yeah, definitely didn't feel too good. I'm glad I was only doing a second gear wheelie instead of a third or a fourth gear wheelie or else uh, I would've been in some serious pain, but it's a little, uh, a little rough right now. <laughs> Oh, remember that ride I told you guys about how we're gonna be having a fun ride today? Well, I think that ride just got canceled because like I said, my hands are shredded. Look at my glove, dude, it's freaking destroyed. I think we're gonna have to call it quits. I'm like super lightheaded for some reason and we just ate. I thought maybe I was like just hungry or something, but your boy is not feeling up to the task right now. God, dude, it's like impossible to grip the bars right now. All right, you guys. Your boy is about to go home and rest and clean up his freaking bullet wounds he got from the asphalt. So I want to thank you guys for tuning in. I'm actually very, very disappointed. I had such a sick ride set up. I was so stoked to do it. I was so sick to put this loop together. And that's what I get for being an idiot. I wasn't even trying to show off or anything. I wish I was. I was just trying to practice my wheelie and I just couldn't find the rear brake and next thing you know I was on the ground. At least I had a good bail. I will take something good away from that as at least my bail was executed perfectly or else it could have been worse. So yeah, that's pretty upsetting. Um, I'm not stoked about the pain that, that's going to come along with this for the next couple days. I just got to wait till it scabs over and then we shall be good. But that being said, man, thank you guys so much for tuning in, man. You guys are absolutely amazing. Sorry for the shorter video. It's just, I can't even ride. Like, I'm holding on to the bike, dude. My glove's shredded. I have to ride with my fingers. I can't even, like, pull in the clutch. Like, I'm literally riding like this uh, just to try to hold on because I got those friggin' uh, uh, scrapes on the, like, palms of my hands. So I can't even ride normal. So thank you guys so much, man. You guys are absolutely amazing. Um, the haters are going to love that I fell. And the rest of you, I hope you uh, bask in my sorrow with me. So thank you guys so much. And I'll talk to you in the next video. Deuces, my friends. Told the world I need everything and some Yeah, two girls, that's a tandem She gon' do it all for me when them bands come Got it all, yeah, I'm